oh, I just got like really emotional, sorry. Um, I think that chosen family has saved my life. Um, chosen family for me are the people that stay and stand beside you even through the hard times. Well, I'm fortunate that my biological family is very much a supportive uh, for, for me. But I also have chosen family. I, ha- I have people who have at various times in my life been family. I have chosen family, and they're very, very um, specifically <laughs> chosen. Chosen family. I think, is is the best thing about what is my main identity, which is my queerness. And the people that I've come to know and who come to become family to me. To replace the family that I lost when I came out. And 30 years ago, when you came out as trans, you didn't tend to keep much. To have people who you just know are going to be fine with you no matter what and no matter who you are you know, our relationships with each other are not founded on any specific expectations other than that we respect and care for each other. Chosen family can be the family that you evolve into because your family, your biological family, abandoned you. The people that surround you with love. And it's the people that you have chosen to say, these are the people who I want to grow in life with and to build my community with and to kind of guide my future. Well, I mean, I don't think I could overstate the importance of chosen family for especially queer kids who, like me, didn't have, like, a queer kid experience. It's closer than family because they're chosen family. Like, they are the people that I would choose to spend my Christmas and holidays with. It's family that they don't have to love you, but they do. And they have your back. When I was outed by my sister... I didn't speak to my parents for eight years. And during that time is where friends really stepped up. And my partner at the time, her family really stepped up as like my chosen family. You know, I really can't explain what it's like to be 15 and lose your entire family that you have been raised to completely and totally rely on for 15 years and when I had no place to go like chosen family or people that I trusted to take me in for a month or two weeks or whatever it was um, I don't think I would be here if it wasn't for chosen family because sometimes the people that are your blood will hurt you the most and so that chosen family is an extra support, an extra connection, an extra sense of place and purpose and belonging. Chosen family is, is, is very important because isolation is, is, is deadly. Chosen family are people who support you. They're the people around you who get you, who support you, who understand you, who you can talk to uh, about the things that you're challenged with on your journey. Chosen family is just a colonial term for what we had anyway. Customary family, customary care, kinship, it's all the same. I know three people in the Waterloo region now that are the same clan as me. We're not related at all, blood-wise, but we're related through our clan system. So I have just now found three siblings, clan siblings, clan family, and that matters to me. That's um, customary family, and in a way, it's a chosen family. So chosen family is really, really important, you know, to give you that support, to make you feel like you belong, that you are a part of something. I genuinely think that chosen family saves a lot of our lives, and without it, I think levels of isolation would be even more so. So one of the things that Spectrum started doing several years ago was having a celebration on December 25th. We called it a celebration of family or a celebration of chosen family. And it really helped a lot of people because that's a day when many people, as I said, feel depressed. It's a hard day for a lot of people. We're not always going to agree. We're not always going to like love each other to the fullest because we're human beings. But chosen family will be with you even through the hard times. Even if it's silently, they're still with you. They're still beside you. They're still holding your hand in some capacity. 
And I'm very grateful that I have that in my life when I didn't actually have my real, my blood family. Yeah, like chosen family helps you understand that like you, blood is important and, and genetics are important and all of that is very real to feeling connected to your biological family. But I think that knowing that you can choose who to have in your circle and knowing that you're not alone in the world is really important for queer people.